And now we move to Franklin County where one school district is dealing with what they say is a contaminated supply of chocolate milk. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey joins us live in studio with more details. Olivia? Abby, I spoke with students who say it was a conversation held across school today. They told me what was inside those curtains. Yeah, it smelled really bad. Smell like crusty socks and vinegar mixed <laughs> together. <laughs> Jenna Lee isn't talking about a class experiment. She's talking about chocolate milk from the cafeteria. On Friday, officials say students of Great Falls Middle School and Turner's Fall High School were served contaminated chocolate milk. Students tell us it had an unforgettable smell, but the sealed curtains looked normal. An expiration date that was like it would last longer. It just smelled bad. Because all the other milks, like everyone seemed like fine about it. Like it didn't smell. Like my friend had like just normal milk and it didn't smell. According to a staff email sent to our newsroom, the supply of chocolate milk cartons were filled with a white, clear, cloudy liquid with a bleach vinegar odor. Superintendent of the Gill Montague Regional Schools District, Brian Beck, tells us on Friday, a student went to the nurse's office with the milk, saying they didn't feel well and the milk smelled weird. The nurse agreed and contacted administration and food service staff. All potentially contaminated milks were removed. Students were notified to not drink the milk and return any that they got from the cafeteria. The Turner's Falls Fire Department was called to identify possible milk contaminants. The fire department then reached out to the Massachusetts State Hazmat Response Team to conduct sampling. The Department of Public Health, Montague Board of Health, and regional public officials were also contacted to distribute the information. We learned the milk was distributed to the high school, middle school, and Sheffield Elementary. Hillcrest Elementary School and Gill Elementary School did not receive these orders of milk, but still inspected theirs and found no contaminants. An investigation is underway, but in the meantime, students say they'll be bringing their lunch for the most part. Here. I normally bring my lunch. Sometimes I'll get a lunch if it seems nice. <laughs> all the school districts in the area were contacted as they all get their milk from the same distributors and plants. The investigation into the incident is ongoing. Reporting live in studio, Olivia Hickey, Western Mass News.